In this video, we'll show you how to acquire and interpret the alternator duty cycle control circuit on GMC vehicles. In this example, a 2018 GMC Acadia is used. The information shown is for a normally working charging system. Using a wiring diagram, locate the control circuit to the alternator from the powertrain control module, or PCM. Insert a specialized back probe into the connector at the alternator for the control circuit. Connect the back probe to a scope test lead. Connect the back probe test lead to channel 1 on your scope. Connect a high amp probe to channel 2 on your scope. Connect the scope ground to battery negative. Turn on the high amp probe. Set the scale and zero the probe. Confirm the direction of current flow through the probe. Next, clamp the probe on the alternator output cable. Start the engine and allow it to idle. Set scope channel 1 to 20 volts DC and 20 milliseconds per division. Set scope channel 2 to 100 amp DC. Once pattern is displayed, set cursors to measure duty cycle. Select measurements tab, then select duty cycle. When measuring duty cycle, you can select an area between cursors or the entire trace. The pattern shown is for a low load on the charging system. The duty cycle is low here, about 30% indicated by the wave pattern. The red current trace indicates the amperage output of the alternator, about 8 amps average. Pattern shown here is high load on the charging system. The duty cycle is high, about 55%, indicated by the wave pattern. The red current trace indicates the amperage output of the alternator, about 70 amps average.